A lot of us, especially like a younger generation, we may not have disposable income, but it would be the same reason we'd want to go out there and buy a new t-shirt or a new hat or some new kicks that could probably cost you the same amount as a piece of art. Is this, what meaning does it have to you? What is the value that it has to you? Is this, this is something that you'll have for a lifetime. There's a difference between being an art collector and appreciating art. It's actually amazing knowing that you've touched somebody enough that they want to use your work to express themselves as well as show the world what their expression is. As far as the partnership with Shopify went, it allowed for a really seamless experience with the art sales. It was a lot easier to push the sales. It happened on the spot, it was quick, it was professional, and it was reliable. In the past, we've had to you know, involve some paper routing and sending out emails, and it's just with Shopify, things get done on the spot, and they get done very easily and efficiently. Shopify is a platform that allows anybody to sell anywhere. So they can sell online, in person, through the point of sale system, and they can sell through social media as well. It's really about allowing the artists to do what they do really well, and we do what we do really well. Combining it, it just allows the artists to sell that much better and that much more. That if somebody has an art show, then they can sell in person at their art show with the point of sale. And then they can also drive people afterwards to their website to see more of their collection or if they haven't quite decided if they want to buy it at the art show but decide afterwards that they want to, they can do that as well. We actually had six contributing photographers. It was part of the 6x6 exhibit that happened this year, which was a co-collaboration and co-curated with One Love To. We really wanted to capture that market that was looking at artwork online and artists online. So this was a huge draw, I would say, for a different community and really the community that follows photographers and follows Instagram and follows art online. Al Natural sold a piece at the show. She was one of the 6x6 photographers, the only female photographer that was represented in 6x6 and only female photographer that showed in the entire show. It makes you feel really good as an artist because having people appreciate your work and your vision, that's just love. It's a nice surprise for you to, to know that someone came in there and amongst over 70 pieces of artwork, they decided to look at yours and say, this, this, is, this is mine. This is something that I want to have as a keepsake. It's always our expectation that we want to sell the artwork more, especially as someone who's coming in as a middle person or coming in as a curator. It's not just your job to get the exposure, but to push the art sales. So someone's interested in buying this piece, so I'm going to add it to the cart, and then I'll hit total, and we'll email them the receipt. Seeing somebody like have the power in their hands to be able to sell it in person as they're standing they're talking to them, it's really, really amazing because they can continue that dialogue even as the transaction is going through. They make it almost foolproof for you. It's very easy. As far as first-time users, this is definitely the platform I would suggest using.